Hey guys, um, I wanted to do a bit of a layout update and show you everything that's changed since the last time I recorded a video and uh, showed you everything I was planning on doing. As you can see, first up here we got some new houses that I got from Akari. Got a lot of about like six of them. I'm using four on the layout right now, two are just in a bin. Um, but I have three right here and I think they look pretty good. I also completed the road here. Uh, I covered up all the plaster. Um, and then put some like sticky asphalt type paper on top of that. It looks pretty good. I might need to fix that up a bit at the end, make it a bit darker to blend it in, but I think it looks pretty good. And then I just have to, there's some white over there that I have to uh, patch up, but yeah, it looks pretty cool. Uh, that turned out really nice. And I think it looks a lot better than what was there before. And then over here, we got the um, three by three foot extension that I made. Um, it look, it came out really nice. It looks really cool. Um, this is another one of the houses I got from Macari. Looks pretty nice. Um, I'm still working on this uh, backdrop mountain scene kind of thing right next to the coal mine. I need to uh, put some more foliage on it on this side and just finish covering it up and then touch up some over there. Then I'm also working on this uh, stone wall at the bottom. I'm not sure whether I'm going to mold something to put there or just use this paper the paper looks all right it's a bit purplish came out weird on the printer um i, I got some like pre-molded uh stone type stuff from amazon but it was really expensive it didn't come with as much as i thought it would i'd have to spend far too much money just to cover up that area down here with the stone wall and i don't think i'm going to use that um but then we have this coal mine here that i built um i built and weathered it from a Walters kit. I don't have any of the signage on it yet. Might leave it plain, might put the signs on, I don't know, we'll see. But it came out really nice. Um, the weathering really looks good on it, I think. And uh, yeah, it just looks pretty cool. We have all the tracks here. Uh, we have the switch and then we have two lines going into the coal mine. Line over here to sit some cars and then a line that goes all the way back the end there um so i just have a lot more storage for um cars and whatever i might be able to put like another really short track here but i don't really know what the point of that would be uh i could but i don't know It'd just be a lot more money buy another switch speaking of switches i need to replace this one before i ballast everything it is a steel switch now i want to replace it with nickel silver before i ballast all the track um, just so it can all be consistent. I'll probably leave this just steel. I think it'll be fine. So I don't have to just buy more track, but yeah. I wanna get that before I ballast it all. But I think it all turn, is turning out pretty well. I'm almost done it all. Uh, I just need to touch up a few things, but it's looking pretty presentable now. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed and uh, stay tuned for more videos in the future if you guys uh, are into this kind of stuff. So see you guys later.